Strident Whistle is a solar bow added to Destiny 2 in Season of the Haunted. This one is a versatile bow with some great perks, and when we've got champion mods related to bows, this is going to be a great option. Well today I'm going to check out the stats, the perks, the god rolls to chase for PvE and PvP, plus also have a look at how to get Strident Whistle in Destiny 2. Well if you're new around here or find this useful, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below for all the latest Destiny 2 content and turn on notifications by hitting that bell. And roughly 98% of viewers who watch this week in video games aren't subscribed, so subscribe today and never miss an update. Well let's get right into it, so how to get Strident Whistle in Destiny 2. Well to get this bow, you're going to want to run Vanguard Ops, and it's a random drop from the end of that activity. So you can farm Vanguard Ops, which are old school strike, and also more modern Battlegrounds activities. And you can also equip Prosperity, a ghost mod, and that'll give you a boost in your chances to get a Vanguard weapon to drop for you when you're doing Vanguard Ops. Well next up, let's have a closer look at Strident Whistle. So Strident Whistle is a legendary energy combat bow with a precision frame, and it's a compound bow, so you've got a longer draw time optimised for damage. Looking at the stats, you've got 76 for impact, 74 for accuracy, 41 for stability, 50 for handling, 40 for reload speed, and it's got a draw time of 684. Well, Strident Whistle is not only powerful, but it's quite easy to get, given that you can farm Vanguard Ops. It's got one of the best perk pools related to bows, although there are a lot of perks, given it's a playlist legendary drop, so getting the exact roll you want could be quite tricky. Well, we've also got Overload Bows in the Seasonal Artifact this season in Season of Plunder, so Strident Whistle is probably going to find more of an audience this time round. So when it was originally introduced in Season of the Haunted, we didn't have champion mods associated with bows, so hopefully more players get this bow in their hands and see exactly how good this thing is. Well, finally, let's have a look at the Strident Whistle God Roll Guide. So for PvE, Well-Rounded and Incandescent would be good. So with well-rounded, throwing a grenade or hitting a target with a charge melee grants a stacking bonus to weapon stability, handling and range, and using a super grants maximum stacks. Then you've got incandescent, so defeating a target spreads scorch to those nearby, and more powerful combatants and opposing guardians cause scorch in a larger radius. For PvP, Archer's Tempo, opening shot would be good. So with Archer's Tempo, draw time decreases after every precision hit. An opening shot, improve accuracy and range on the opening shot of the attack. Well, let me know in the comments what you think about Strident Whistle, and let me know your favourite roles. Well, that is it for this guide for how to get the Strident Whistle in Destiny 2, and as always, thank you so much for watching or listening. For more Destiny 2 content like this, hit that subscribe button down below and subscribe to This Week in Video Games. Or you can check me out on Twitter at TWIVG Podcast. If you enjoyed this video, found it useful, liking and sharing the video would really help me out. Otherwise, check out the other videos on the channel. Well, thanks again, and I'll see you soon.